Hey guys, so I'm doing a little intro right here because I forgot to really actually vlog at the comic store and at the Tate's Comics uh, Japanese snack taste testing. Um, they have this every year. I did not go to the one last year. This is my first time ever at Tate's Comics. This is what little footage I have from it, honestly. I was just so stuck in the awe of everything that was going on in the store. If you've ever been to a Tate's comic store ever before, like, yeah, it's like, huh? What? What? Yes, yes, yes. Like, there's this one, like, sexy Alice in Wonderland uh, figurine. I might insert a picture right here. Um, it's really really pretty and I really want it and I already told my fiance and I already winked at him about it. I'm like you know Christmas is coming up that's hurting my eyeball there's something in it oh crap anyways but um it's literally like a five minute vlog that's all there at that's all there is it's all that I had sorry not sorry um I'm gonna be recording a review video for you guys for with a my very first review video actually I believe I don't think I've ever recorded a review video other than the books that I've read in the past but without it without further ado on to the video okay guys so I'm at Walgreens right now and I'm like obsessing over all of their Halloween costume stuff like what? I want to be a dragon. I think I am. I might come back. If I don't know if these would fit me, I think I can make them my own better because I do have material that looks exactly like this. So I kind of want to be like a mystic dead mermaid with a hook through my mouth with like FX makeup because I got that kit last year. Um, this one I got last year. Yeah, basically, and then I got a whole thing of the fake blood. But yeah, these FX kits are good, but I do recommend if you're, like, building up, like, fake skin. This stuff only works for, like, little tiny scars, not for, like, building up with, like, late liquid latex. And they had totally better stencils last year. Like, what the hell? But this is cool. I got some pets. Oh, this is my favorite. They're little squishies. Look, you just... They're so soft. If you could just, like, poke them through the camera. Oh, there's a cat. A candy corn. I can't reach. I'm too small. I really like this one. This is my favorite. It's a witch. And there's just, like, your basic like glittery stuff but all the wicked stuff is all over here and it's just so cool you even have your day of the dead candles here that you can get at most uh, quick marts and stuff but this is so cool what so he's supposed to look like he has a moon hmm interesting but anyways this is basically like all that's here for Halloween on this aisle Obviously the candies right across it. They're still stocking it up, but I'm excited. Who's excited for Halloween? I am So this is like some strawberry milk tea yep. It's really sweet. It's like It's like strawberry milk the green stuff is really straight. Yeah, it's like uh, that it's this is uh, Yeah, it is strawberry milk tea. Oh, okay. It is a tea. What mochi, chocolate, mint, green tea. I like this though, it's like a Cheeto cheese puff. Actually, that's not bad. That's our really good. Like seaweed. That one? A little bit. But yeah. then here's the real seaweed. Yeah, did, you know, it really tastes like seaweed. Did they say it was wasabi? Yeah, they 
Yeah. yeah. Wasabi flavor. Oh yeah, I taste it. So. I don't know. It's okay. I like this hot. I, I can find better seaweed. <laughs> First thing I got to the Yeah, seaweed pretty much is like a little spicy. What's that? There's more people here. What? What's that? Yeah, right. Now you're making me worried. And then there's like ramen. <laughs> got a little kick. Yep. <laughs> Good stuff. I wasn't, didn't think it was going to have that much work here. Oh, it's not bad. Interesting. I like the ramen. I felt that. the green tea chocolate. I like this. <laughs> You're whistling. We're laughing because we were just watching a uh, anime about Japanese candy stores. And the last episode we saw was all about the whistle candy. <laughs> <laughs> and this is like a candy, so I'm going to save this for later. It's fresh plum. Yep. Whistle candy. I'm going to save it for later. And there's these two candies. Let's blow through it. I love it. Put it in front. Do you okay. remember what flavor this is? Strawberry. Ramune and strawberry. Yeah. What is the white one again? Ramune. Ramune? It's the soda. It's the original flavor of the soda. Cool, I'll be sweet. honest with you, I don't think I've had the original flavor. Like if I tried one, it was like maybe a sip of like a friend's. And it was in like Epcot. So I told myself I would buy, my, I would buy one before I leave. So. What's in this one? It's got something in it. Plum. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, okay. What? And then everything is back there. Yeah, but these it's a whistle. Really? It's a whistle. Mm -hmm. You blow through it. Blow through the hole. I can't do it. Can go home. Can't do it? Mm -hmm. I hear a lot of whistling starting to go on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then you have to fill this out. Okay. Well, you like it because I like the Alright. Interesting. So I'm going to fill this out and drink the last of my milk. This is the result. Are you happy now? <laughs> <laughs> That's the result. So we just got a Yeah. Best part is, there's hockey. Like, what? And they don't have these except for in Epcot. They only have these in Japan, Pele, and Epcot. I've never seen them anywhere else. What is it called? Ramoon. Is it Ramoon or Raymoon? Ramoon. Raymoon, ramen, ramen. And then they have these ramen chips that I really want. It's too expensive because $5 for a bag of chips is bullshit. They're standing outside behind us. Not <laughs> really. Oh gosh. And then, yeah, yes. She's probably waiting for her sister still. And then they only had this here inside the side of uh, the other, uh, Tate's comic side with the snack taste testing going on in it. They had the, what is it, mango lime? The cherry lime's the best. 